Hey, this is Jeremy from Production Den. I'm going to show you how to install Massive in FL Studio really quickly. Let's jump in. So let's make sure that we have Access opened up, Native Access, and you're going to go down to your installed products. You're going to make sure that that has been installed, Massive. And what you need to do is go over to this selection over here where it says Installation Path and make a note of this VST64 location. This tells you where the plugin is actually located on your computer and you're gonna need this when we actually jump into the plugin manager in FL Studio. So let's go back over to FL Studio. We're gonna right click on the plugin database and we're gonna say manage plugins. Now over here, we're gonna add the folder that we were just looking at. So we'll go under computer, we'll go under C, program, native instruments, and we'll go to that 64-bit plugin folder. Now that's been added to it, so now we're gonna do a scan of the system again. And this will take a little while. Where am I type? No time at all. So if you go down to the bottom, you're gonna see that massive has been detected down here. So close out the plugin browser, and you're gonna go down to this installed, generators and VST and you'll see that massive has shown up down here so let's click on this drag it over here and now we have massive in our uh, channel rack all right so now I'm going to show you another trick which is where you can add it to a menu of existing synths so that you can pull it up easily and quickly so let's go under synth classic under generators this is still underneath the plugin database folder and you'll see plugins like 3x os and fruity dx10 and we're going to add massive to this list of synth classics so let's go up here to this drop down arrow click on add to plugin database flag as favorite it's going to give you a warning window that says you're about to add it to the subcategory say okay and what you'll see is massive has now been added into this menu so what does that mean exactly well if you click on this button down here to add a plug into your channel rack it's going to automatically show up under your synth classics menu you'll see it down here at the very bottom it might be in a different location for you depending on how many synths you have in your system and you can add it really quickly really easily into your channel rack or there's another option of coming up here and doing the same thing you come down to your synth classics find massive and add it into your channel rack so hopefully that was helpful to you guys if you have any questions leave them in the comments below and we'll try to answer them as quickly as possible if you like what you see, just go ahead and get subscribed so that you can get notified when there's new videos that are uploaded. Thanks, and I'll see you again soon.